you can't say, I don't like it when people say, oh, I'm doing things that are narcissistic in nature. Well, then you're a narcissist. If you're doing things that are alcoholic in nature, you're an alcoholic. If you're doing things that Can are you drug tell Rick nature, to that? Will you tell <laughs> Rick to that? That if you do things that are unalcoholic in nature, you're an alcoholic? I doubt that he'll tell old Rick to that one. Right? Uh, let's go into the Steel Toe Morning Show briefly. Okay. Uh, okay, so Rick to, uh says this. He says, sorry, guys. Nasty fucking migraine. Not doing show. Cannot focus on computer monitors all night. Tomorrow, Megan Fox joins for an insane lawsuit of pregnancy. By being... So this this reason for cancellation was a lie. Mm. The actual reason was that Steel Tone Morning Show was at his house. And he, and he, he leaked it by accident? No, they actually just openly said that they were at his house. Yeah, this is them exposing it. We'll do this first. All right, this cool, is, this cool. Give you guys a great show because you deserve it. You're going to throw a bunch of money at this program today. And by the way, so April, his wife, quit after our segment was posted on YouTube. Yeah, we have that. That's the third one. Okay, okay. Uh, yeah, that's why she's missing here. Her yeah. quitting. That's why she's missing. And also, Rakeda is returning back to law. So Rakeda is finally going to get back in the courtroom and fight the good fight. And you know who he's representing? Mm. He's representing April oh, yeah. on a speeding ticket. She'll lose because, her license. <laughs> because if she gets convicted on this ticket, she's going to lose her license. So she called in the big guns. She called in Rakeda. I think she would have been better off contesting it herself. Yeah. But she's but losing Rikeda, her license. Rakeda is gambling that the prosecutor that day won't want to go through a full case <laughs> in traffic court. And so he'll drop it. But if the prosecutor does go through the full case, Rakeda will be taking a full L in court. Oh. Well, Hot Fart Fernando says she's getting the chair. Like, they're going to up the yeah, fucking... Some, somehow she gets the death penalty. You know? <laughs> Rakeda said I could speed. <laughs> we're going to knock out all these goals, and we're going to have a great week. Uh, we're also doing... We're going to not hit the goal? Is that what he said? We're not going to hit it. <laughs> Doing an evening show tonight. I will probably, uh, I know I'm going to go hang out with uh, Nick and his family today. There uh -oh. it goes. Oh, right there. The whole lie was exposed. The Liar. facade came crumbling down. <laughs> Rikeda lied. He was swinging with this guy and his wife rather than do his show. All right, let's Based. go to the next video, which is. I like how you're like, that's enough. <laughs> that's enough. <laughs> these bombs uh, all right, all right. This anonymous. Is him. what's this this is so f***ed. so his wife because we bullied her and everybody was bullying her it wasn't online, bullying it was just it, wasn't. it, was, it was criticism some, it was some light-hearted jokes and banter and a little bit of criticism yeah and she just couldn't handle it she's quit the internet quit the show and now this guy is doing like a groveling like kowtow apology saying he's garbage he's worthless he's what? a narcissist steve i'm so sorry uh april is uh, we can officially say now uh april is done with uh the steel toe show she is <laughs> after hearing rich for that whole time i was expecting him to hit the clapping sound effect i know she is done <laughs> is april is done with uh the steel toe show Whoa. she is She's doing better. Let's put it that okay. way. Did we... She's doing better. <laughs> like, people online just completely shattered her psyche. Like, is she in a mental hospital? Like, oh. Did she contract internet cancer from the vicious words that were being used? Like, Aaron. she's doing better, guys. Like, Was on. it that bad? Were we that mean? We were pretty mean. Well, we weren't mean. Oh. We were kind of nice, I think. She deserved it. She cried. Because She's swinging with the Rakeda household. Right. She took the baldo, for right. God's sake. All right, Suffer Horror said we were mean. All right, pretty mean, but f her. Okay, fair enough. Doing better, but uh, I. she doesn't want to go back. Uh, oh. She doesn't want to go back to the abuse. She doesn't- The abuse? 
this. The we, abuse. Did, we did Listen, one you do segment. An internet show. And by the way, these guys shit on like everybody. Everyone. Like they're always shitting on people. So they can dish it out, but they can't take the abuse. And she was like, whose fault was it? You decided to bring her on the show, which he's going to admit it was his own fault, which I think is hilarious. Okay. Doesn't want to go back to the meanness. She doesn't. Basically, what I, I, if I'm if I'm getting it right, I could be wrong. You could be wrong. She's your wife. Like, like. What do you mean you don't know? What do you mean you don't know? She didn't tell you. But I think just being out in the public and having people say things about you that, uh, one time she said something perfect. Uh, she said, "If I ever uh, go and like go to get other work." That shit can follow me around. Well, you should so, have thought about that before you decided to launch an online show. Where you A-log people and make fun of people. I, I don't know what to tell you, bud. Oh, I understand that. I think it's important. Uh, it's caused me to like look back on a lot of things, too. And, and I'm going to say this. I don't... Um, and it's too I late. I don't think it was like, a if good that idea. Was actually... If that was actually her concern, it's already too late. You already did the show. Yeah. So what do you <laughs> what do you think's gonna happen now? Exactly. People are gonna forget you did the show. <laughs> on my part, to ask April to come and work here full time. A, being a woman on the internet is terrible. And B, I've been kind of going through things in my head. I think it was a remarkably narcissistic move on my part to do it in the first place. And there's a oh lot. God. There's a lot of pieces. He um, should honestly just take off his shirt and just start whipping himself. Yeah. He should just whip himself through the show. I'm sorry, April. I'm sorry I made you do this. I'm a narcissist. I'm sorry. Like, what a pathetic, groveling bitch. But she's, she's a grown ass woman who can make her own fucking decisions. She's your fucking wife, bro. But she's been on oh, yeah. the show for like a year. Like,. She, uh, well, yeah, it obviously was a fucking terrible decision. Yeah, of course. To do a fucking internet show with your wife. It's stupid. But it's never, it's never worked ever, especially with like a negative audience and a negative style show. Like, it's just not gonna work, bro. That I've been thinking about, uh, due to all this, the online stuff, and uh, you know, April leaving the show, and and you know, what's their show about, Ashton? What do they do? It's, it's just a ripoff of fucking Open Anthony. Anthony, Anthony, Red Bar, and the rest, yeah. Okay. Get her time off and everything. Uh, and that is that a lot of my behavior has been... That I, I'm not even... You know what? I'm not even going to say that it was... <laughs> Someone just said, so, it's shit. Oh, the A-log stuttering John. He's talking about his behavior... But it was your wife's decision and your wife's behavior to take her clothes off on stream for money. Now, you decided to whore your wife out for money, but she could have refused to do it. You understand we live in, like, a feminist age, and this is definitely, like, a feminist female-led marriage. Be real. This guy doesn't wear the fucking pants. So it's bullshit. He just has to blame it all on himself and whip himself through. Forgive me! Forgive me. Like, it's well, pathetic. she was the one, too, the who said rip, bro. that he doesn't make her come. She, she yeah. said that. Narcissistic behavior, because that sounds like an excuse. I'm a narcissist. And I need... Whoa. Beta. Are you proud? Beta. To stop. I'm and, he has uh, to admit I, to being a narcissist. You know? Like, just fucking shut, off, shut down the show, bro. It's, it's time to log off. Like, you're at the point where you're groveling before your audience for forgiveness, declaring yourself to be a narcissistic piece of shit. What's wrong with Stop, you? Stop, buddy. Come on. Fucking be a man. I, I will say, and I'm very proud of this, uh, next week, I am going to, uh, I, well, I'm going to look tonight, uh -huh. but I have gotten some good resources. I'm going to go figure out how to not be one, or, or how to... Okay, just shut the fuck oh, up, Oh, my. Wait. So now he's so going she forced to therapy? Him? Is she forced yeah, she, him to like say this on the air and oh humiliate God. himself even more? So bad the humiliation ritual that like why do you have to yeah. tell the internet this? Yeah. All, all you have to do is say, My wife doesn't feel comfortable doing the show anymore. I know she'll be missed, but I hope to still be able to entertain you guys going forward. 
I have plans for a new co-host or not. Like, that's really all you have to say. Yeah. And I think everybody can fill in the blanks that she didn't like, that she got made fun of. There was an audience backlash and stuff like this. But, like, for you to go to the extent of, like, I'm going to therapy to stop being a <gasps> narcissist because my wife put me in the cock cage and Baldo pegged me. Like, just stop, bro. Have some fucking dignity, that's bro. That's twisted. Yeah, it's really like, embarrassing. And it's like... Your this is your job, and it's already on the rocks as it is. I'm checking the social blade. F me, I don't even want to show you guys. It's like we've, it's bad enough. It's bad. It's the worst I've ever seen. Are you checking? Is that what you're you're, you're gonna click on? <laughs> it's really, we'll it's really bad, dude. Not be that kind of guy. Yeah, my, my point is, it's already doing bad. This is your job. Shouldn't your wife understand, even if she is upset, like, honey, I can't do this online. It's going to affect my job even more and be even more embarrassing. So. Um, and I think it'll help my relationship. It'll help my marriage. Um, I think it'll help my other relationships hey, with other people. Why is it? Why is it any of your why Any of our business, what your marriage is like at all? We don't care about your fucking marriage, no. bro. The only people that would care about your marriage are people that want to make fun of you about it and shit on you. It's not a good idea to make stuff like this public because you're just going to get mocked. He just still hasn't learned anything. Yeah. It's re well, nor do we care about your relationships with your friends. F off. Either put, on <laughs> either put on an entertaining, compelling, informative show or f off and leave. Yeah. Yeah. For real. This is stupid. You're right. The only people who give a f about this is like like their a logs people who like to gossip about this shit and da, da, da. All, all six of them yeah <laughs> real well i think it'll help me be a better father not that i, I think i'm a, a stellar father i really do but you can always be better um i can be a better well, husband uh, obviously if you're a narcissist psycho like you're saying you're clearly not a good father right you know i mean this be a is better... stuff that she put in his head yeah, he's oh, definitely. No, dude, and he's, he's having, reading a teleprompter. Yeah, no, he's there's like a gun to his head, which is the divorce papers. Yeah. And he's worried that he's about to get divorced and raped for what little money he has. So he's just sitting here reading out this fucking like hostage message. She's holding I'm the... a narcissist. Uh, please forgive me. I need to be better in my marriage and with my friend. Like, look how uncomfortable he is. Yeah, you're right. She's like, those casino guys were right. I think I'm a, a stellar father. I really do. But you can always be better. He's reading. He's literally reading a f***ing yeah. script. Um, I can be a better husband. I can be a better friend. I can be a better everything. And so as I've been thinking about this whole thing, I've been thinking. Is he not reading, like, literally, like, off camera? <laughs> like, yeah. whatever's on the left there is no. just, like, he's got Stevie point just, point. Stevie just felt it him so bad. He goes, he seems like a narcissist. He's streaming into the void for his ego. <laughs> if he's about, how is the show called Steel Toe? It's weak as f <laughs> what was What was the idea behind that? The Steel Toe show. Like, it's really? really? I hate that background. Don't you? It's trash. It, it, it feels like they're at a convention. It feels like a public access show or like yeah. a convention booth. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like the, convention. Yeah, the convention booth that you'd put up. Yeah. <laughs> Thinking about a lot of the things I've done for just like the last, I'd say, seven, eight, nine, ten years of my life. What's this picture on the bottom left, Ash? Who is this? I don't know. Is that Royce? No is that Royce from Revenge no, of the Sith? No, it's not. It's not Royce. Who's that? And I would say, you know, you can't say, I don't like it when people say, oh, I'm doing things that are narcissistic in nature. Well, then you're a narcissist. If you're doing things that are alcoholic in nature, you're an alcoholic. If you're doing things that Can are drug addict Can you tell Rickada nature, that? <laughs> Will you tell Rickada that? That if you do things that are an alcoholic in nature, you're an alcoholic. <laughs> I doubt that it'll tell old Rickay to that one. Okay? <laughs> you're a drug addict. If you're doing things that are narcissistic it was in nature. crazy, by the way. But it doesn't necessarily mean just because you exhibit behavior that fits into one criteria of narcissistic personality disorder does not mean that you have narcissistic personality disorder. Yeah, well, that's well, retarded. That's and, like Bobby's understanding of psychology. 
first semester like level well, like what's well, this guy talking about well narcissism everyone has has a little bit in some regard i mean it's like it's a well, spectrum. you have to have some level have of ego. ego you have yeah, to have some ego. level of pride about yourself no. what this looks like to me is not a narcissist no this looks like to me a spineless blobfish groveling in the mud for his wife's forgiveness if someone what it looks has like to me if someone has npd what, they're they not resist doing this. this humiliation yeah, they won't resist this. this humiliation they're they're like, all you. they'll actually make the person feel bad for yeah. being upset right that's the whole point of npd right nature you're a narcissist and there's no way for me to get better uh there's no way for me to be a better person and be a better partner is she looking him dead at the in the eyes bro like know. bro like he keeps looking over like there's no way uh, for me to get better uh there's no way for me to be a better person by and the be way, a better if your co-host is gone do you have to show the empty chair can you straight like can you sit it's in so the middle? Lonely. The yeah. optics of it are terrible. Yeah, like just like, sit in the middle. Like sit in the middle of the fucking. I'm a lonely, <laughs> broken-hearted man. No, your chat hates this guy. Our chat. Well, I don't know. Any, I know so. barely anything about this guy. Oh, but I know nothing about him. You know. Yeah, yeah. Uh, then it's tough to a log him because we're like, I don't know. It's like everyone yeah. wants us to. They beg us, please. He locked this guy Let's up. be real. By that, you mean one guy is <laughs> Yeah, James. <laughs> no, James wants us to A-log EVS really badly. You know, CRP I, then, I, now, and forever for $5. He has a great idea for Gumroad. When it starts working again, <laughs> subscribe. Subscribe for $10 because there's never been a better time because the uploading is broken. But CRP then, now, and forever has said, mm. when are y'all going to review the classic Fuentes versus Coach Red Pill Kumite where Nick Feltz Coach Red Pill? But Coach Red Pill's Chilean wisdom predicts Nick Fuentes' downfall oh. due to being a vindictive, bridge-burning you loser. Yeah, Coach Red Pill. We should do that. It's going to be like uh, the, the sector flashback or something, a better name than that, where we go back over the greatest moments in sector should, history on yeah. Dumb Road. Greatest moments of sect in sector history. <laughs> I'm going to put I'm a narcissist. Put a reminder for That's you. a great idea, actually. I like that idea. We should watch the Dominic Pesos, the Tonka. Yes. I remember there's a part where uh, where, where Tonka's like, you do coke, Andy. I'm like, I don't give a f I'll do it right now. And then he tells the girl, the, the what was her name? The, the the fighter who set up the fight. What was her name? Uh, I can't remember. Her oh, name. I, f I forget her you name remember her too. Name? And then he's like, she does coke. And then she's like, he does no one gives a f if he sticks a needle up in his fucking has a needle hanging out of his arm. They'll let him fight. <laughs> Ro, no, not Ro, Tara La Rosa. Tara La Rosa. Yeah, Tara Remember when I told La Rosa, Tara La Rosa to go fuck yourself? I got so mad. I was just like, oh shit. And I felt it her and geek. He was like, no, Andy. <laughs> we was Chuds has a name for it. He calls it instead of history, it's sectory. Ooh, I don't know. Okay. Sectory. Okay. Or, you know, we have, what What was the other name? Sectorpedia is an idea. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. They're not really hitting yet. Sector's yeah. greatest hit. We have to think about it. Might be sectory. I don't know. It came from it the sector. It, doesn't, it came from the sector might be good. Yeah, you know. Um, Andy won the push-up contest versus Ralph. Do you remember that? I, I, I did. And he and tries, he tries to, to kick, kick your me. leg. He tries to kick you. And then I start doing clapping push-ups. He just he, mogged he just, him so bad. He was mogged brutally. The best part about that, when the camera pans, Coach Red Pill's like dying laughing. Oh, uh, Coach, why didn't you make that movie, you fuck? It, was, it would have been so fucking keen. Oh, shit. Sector and I guess saying Chronicles? it into a Chronicles? I don't know. Uh, I like that one. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Microphone on a show is not good either. I, maybe I shouldn't be doing that. I, <laughs> maybe I should be more humble about uh, uh, being a narcissist. Um, but I think asking what? April to come work here was a narcissistic uh, move. That was the move of a narcissist. Oh, my no, God. It, it, no, it was like you... It was ballsy, like, to do that. That's what it's the stupidest know, thing was, ever. It was just stupid. It's, it's stupid. not that you're a narcissist. If he was a narcissist, wouldn't he only want to show himself? Himself. Wouldn't he not... 
wouldn't he not want to share the spotlight with a co-host at all? Especially his wife. Now, and maybe it was that he men. wanted... Maybe it is that he was a narcissist and he wanted to show everybody how hot his wife was, but I don't think that really follows. Like, it's just He's a not very a narcissist. Decision. He's bending, like, narcissists don't do this. Oh, please. Was I Unless he is one and the divorce... A, a, a divorce paper like situation he is real. He just has no choice. I yeah. Don't know. You know. Wanted her here. I wanted her with me. And the, like, it doesn't matter what the motivation is. It doesn't matter that I wanted her. I wanted to be close to her. I wanted. I had fun doing shows with her. I really enjoyed it. It was great. I didn't consider the repercussions. I didn't consider the impact it could have. You didn't consider that being on an A log show where you make fun of people, having your woman <laughs> beside you wouldn't possibly have people attack back at oh your my, girl. That's so dumb. So Are you stupid? Dumb. Holy buddy. Get a have been around all the time. I didn't consider the fact that the internet can be fucking terrible to people. What? You know what? Here, here's, <laughs> I think, you know what? I think this is it. Tales from the Sector. Yeah, Tales from the Sector. Oh, Tales, like Tales from the Sector. Tales from the Crypt. But it's I Tales like from that. The yeah. There's a lot of content there. It's probably like over 100 and something episodes. And I expected her to just handle it the way I would handle it. That's why I said, just do it the way I do it. I would always say, well, narcissists do that. You don't want to do yeah. that. Yeah. This is a hard alert. Bro. Imagine thinking that your wife would handle oh criticism God. and mockery online in the exact same way you did. It's so dumb. So I, I pushed. I mean, look, was April thrilled when she came to work here? As far as I remember, yes. I mean, the audience can tell me the same or different. Right. Um. But it was my job to make sure that she knew what to expect going in. And is he wearing an Under Armour shirt? Man, this guy is so frail way, no. and weak. Why is he so weak? Is that an Under Armour shirt? I think I, so. I mean, pardon the pun. We're about but to like, like look we're at on this the, fucking yeah, like. We're on the this same. This guy's got like just like Dracula fucking hairline too. Like no, dude, it's thinking... over, bro. Just fucking shave it, bro. Buddy. It's gone. It's gone, bud. It's gone. You can't have Under Armour shirts and it be loose on you when it's a medium. Just say this is crazy. There should be a, there should be a little bit of like a, a ball, you know, somewhat. I don't know, man. I didn't do and that. And he's got boobs. He does have straight up. I know he's got huge boobs. man tits. And he's skinny. At, at like sk 120 pounds, stick figure man tits, like case of Gina. Like I know. I, Whoa, buddy, it was over before it began for this guy. You know, yeah. He's just straight up beta box getting simped out by his wife. And he's having to sit here and like bow down. Please, honey, I'm so sorry. I'm such a narcissist. Forgive me, honey, for whoring you out, even though it was your decision to take your clothes off and be a part of this shit. Like, you're a dumbass, pal. You're a fool, and you deserve what's coming to you. His you are, are going to get divorced. You are going to get divorced. And you're going to lose everything and you're going to end up in the gutter. How is it pronounced? Gynoclamastia or is it genoclamastia? Gynoclamastia? Gosh, look at those nips. Look at this nip right here. Holy f***. That's like pointing right at me. Uh, so, yeah, I'm going to say that. Who's uh, the first one that you said? Yeah, gynoclamastia. Okay. Yeah, I am a narcissist. And I need to. You're not. Uh, you are a <laughs> spineless worm. You are a joke. Buddy, is he okay? What is he looking at? I'll, I'll read some of the stuff in the chat here that I'm seeing. So, Ash! Okay, my theory was correct. The chat is on... Okay, I should just press this. Narcissist. The chat, look, Ash. Look at him right here. The chat, he's looking to the right. And I need to... Watch. Uh, and I'll, I'll read some of this. He's going, so he's, what? So he's, something's happening over on the left. People were saying, oh, it's the chat. No, 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 no. The chat's on the right. On the left is his, is April holding a Bristol board, like elementary school style, with a fucking marker that goes, you're going to say this and this and this. Stuff in the chat here that I'm seeing. Um, I'm going to go figure out how to be less of a narcissist. I think that's healthy. I think that's a good thing to say, here's what I am. Let's not do that because I don't want to. Or is he looking directly in the OBS, which would be fucking ironic that he's looking at himself. To be that. I don't want to uh, 
you know, string, you don't want to string people along. You don't want to like, um, you know, do that thing where, oh yeah, be around all the time because I love you and it's this and it's that. And it's that. That's, that's smothering behavior. That's, that's, you're doing it because it makes you feel good. You like the dopamine rush you get from that person being next to you all the time. But you know what's really helpful? This guy watched like a fucking, so let's put this in chat, a nerd city video and like diagnose fucking narcissism. Yeah, Nickers, Nickers is so right here. It is like an ISIS video. Like it is. <laughs> it's the hostage tape straight up. Yeah. Healthy, going to work every day and then seeing each other when you get home. That's a remarkably healthy relationship. Oh my God. And if you work together and you never get a fucking break, you always, by not getting what? a fucking break, any break he's seems just, like- He's spiraling, like he's losing his mind and seething. Like, I tell you this right now, that's not the reason your marriage is failing. The reason that your marriage is failing is because you're a limp-wristed and you don't it's failing. And you don't make your fucking woman come ever, like. That's the reality of why it's failing. You know? Straight up, Andy, you nailed it. Like, that's it. It's... He can't make this woman come. So she's sexually frustrated. She's thinking about other men. Yep. You're failing to protect her as a man. You're failing to provide for her because the show has people mocking her and you're making pennies in the gutter. Like, figure it out. Mm -hmm. This guy got fired from local radio. It's pretty hard to get fired from local fucking radio. What? Because he's an idiot. How was he fired? Does anyone know? Well, I guess, or he quit. I don't know. Buddy. It was like some sort of story where he was sent. I don't even know. I, <laughs> I, like how, I like how we just don't know anything. How did that happen? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> That's narcissism. So, dude, bro goes, who the hell is this? Listen, it's not. There's no even point in letting you know. Don't worry. How about that? We're almost done this segment. Trust us. Let's make fun of him and move on. It'll be better for everyone involved. Having, having April off the show, going to do something else, you can get back to that, I haven't seen you all day. I missed you. That's great. Let's watch a movie or something. Instead of, hey, did we get that prize thing done? Hey, what are we doing on the show tomorrow? Hey, are you feeling okay? Like, to do the show tomorrow, you're going to be all right. Who wants that life? I found out I don't want that life. Unfortunately, April found out first, but I found out I don't want that life. <laughs> <laughs> I was being a narcissist. I was she a narcissist. She one. found out first, and then she t demanded and whipped you in the line. And that's why you're making this f***ing video. <laughs>